The 62 mid-Missouri veterans and their guardians on Central Missouri's 18th honor flight left Columbia at about 2.30 Tuesday morning, headed to the nation's capital. Just about 24 hours later, they were back in the heart of Missouri for a hero's welcome home. Before the veterans made it back, Reed Hickam met up with hundreds of other honor flight riders in Kingdom City to pay tribute. In the military, when they were at war with the Nazis and the Japanese, uh, they stood in pouring rain, they stood in ditches, they, they went through things that we couldn't even imagine that they went through. So us standing out here in the middle of the night waiting on them guys is nothing compared to what they did for us. And we all gladly stand out here and wait for them. Nearly 500 motorcycles escorted the honor flight buses back to Columbia. American flags lined the street and cheering greeted each biker as they made their way into the Courtyard Marriott. But this was only the beginning. Within moments, the cheers grew louder and emotions ran higher as the buses pulled in. Bagpipes played as America's heroes got off the bus one by one, many overwhelmed by their greeting. I swear it's the best day of my life. I, I couldn't believe what I said. I had one swell day. It was great. In their whirlwind 24-hour trip. I hadn't been asleep since... 4 o'clock Monday morning. These veterans bonded with one another and saw sights they never thought they would. Still a dream. Has to be. Honor Flight is a program to show respect and give thanks to our veterans, our heroes, a name which they say isn't theirs to claim. I ain't no hero, girl. No, I'm not a hero. No, 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 no. You don't... You got to look at these old, some of these old boys. You can see some heroes. The heroes are them guys that was with me that had laid out in the mud and looked down the wrong end of a rifle barrel. Now, them's the heroes. The 18th Missouri Honor Flight is one these veterans will always cherish. Megan Lane, CARE CG 13 News.